All right, guys, you're welcome back. It's still The Breakfast Show. And like I said earlier, our first sit-down is going to be very, very insightful and interesting. We're going to learn one or two things and know what makes this man think. Now, a lot of people know him as a one particular name. Let me just talk about the name that his mother and father gave him. His name is Innocent Chukuma Ide. But a lot of people call him one so. Why he gave himself one so? He's a filmmaker, he's a producer, he's a director, he's a businessman, he's a musician. Uh, I'm telling you, all in Everything. one body. All in one, but how he manages to do all that, I don't know. But we're going to be talking to him. And with so many movies, short movies to his name and a lot of documentaries, uh, he will explain to us how he did it. Also, welcome to the studio, man. <laughs> how you doing, man? My shoes, Just by like, the way. Thank you. Just like taking advantage of What did I do? <laughs> yeah. Take advantage of you. Like, trying to read my own autobiography. Uh, well, I just had to make but, it but, fast. But you, you've, lost, uh, you've lost the hand in them. In what? Which one? You've which lost one? hand. Things happen. Very fast. Oh, so yeah, nah, you need to us. go and receive. Yeah, 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 Tell us, tell us, tell us what he missed out, all the things that he um, should have said. I mean, no, 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 not, not too much from the fact that um, I am still who I am, but I'm trying to add one more. Add okay. this, yeah. so I want to be a farmer now. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I wasn't surprised, yeah. but I wasn't even surprised. You I also do, venture into that. I want to into farming. the money. Why do you want to get into farming, though? I mean, um... We have, I have role models like <laughs> Mike Adenuga um, <laughs> and the rest of these guys, mm -hmm. Dangote. Mm -hmm. ah, these guys are selling everything. <laughs> you understand? So you cannot want to have that kind of money and you want to just be somewhere. Okay, guys, so we are not talking about farming. <laughs> Do not listen to him. We're talking about movies and movie production and everything. Oh you can be part God. of this segment by calling in on 070. I probably want to say that part of my career. 070 <laughs> <laughs> R2TV and call in and talk to Wonso. Let's talk to him. Now, Wonso, yeah. let, let's, let's just get straight to it now. There are a lot of young directors out there now. Yeah. Let, let, me, let me just start with you from the director's mm -hmm. director's I'm going to take everything one by one. Yeah. There are a lot of young directors out there right now. Some think, oh, the cinema movies are the, the, way, the way forward. Some mm -hmm. think, uh, the short movies, you have done a lot of short movies. Yeah. As a, what's, what is your take on all this when it comes to movies? Right I now? mean, first of all, Go down, look. I am very, very happy with the fact that the industry is changing. Okay. Mm. You know, the industry is changing. And one, two years from now, it's still going to change. Sure, sir. Okay. Do you understand? There used to be the same way the music business has evolved, where this kid will go to America, he will have a soda concert True. in London. The Nigerian film industry okay. is coming to that level. Hmm. Right. Um, I said it to the other day, I said the other day, the Indian movies they show here, but none of our films has ever made it to the Indian cinema. Hmm. What is happening? Um, the American movies they show here. Trust me, lately, some people think they are premiering their film in the UK, mm -hmm. in the America. After premiering, does it show? Premiering yes, is different, from, different showing. from showing. Mm -hmm. We have Fast and Furious making billion billions of dollars internationally, Global in the international yeah. market. Mm -hmm. It is because those guys, they've made their marks. They, I, I don't want to compare the Hollywood to, to the Nollywood. We are not mates. They've been there. Do you understand? Um, while somebody is celebrating that he's, he's made 500 million, in Nigerian box office, mm -hmm. or about a billionaire, less than a billionaire in a German box office, and the person is so excited. I was like, okay, um, Fast and Furious made mm -hmm. billions of dollars, mm -hmm. and you're counting naira, less than a billionaire. So, but like it or not, you want to still give credit mm -hmm. to the change. There used to be a time where you go to the cinema, and all you see is the foreign, the foreign, foreign movies. movies. Mm -hmm. Our films are not even shown. There used to be a time we don't even have cinemas at all. At all. We just had the Penn Cinema and some other local ones that yeah. yes. you and I maybe then we look for <laughs> 100 or two, 300 and I go and see. Sure. Those ones shut down. Mm -hmm. Then some new guys started reinventing or reintroducing this thing. And now we have cinemas. But I don't still think it's enough because, for instance, in South Africa, they are like, maybe this VI, there are probably 20, 30 cinemas in the whole of VI. How many do we have in Lagos? Sure. So we're growing. Um, but why is that growth happening? The, now, because when you go to our Nigerian cinemas, you see one, two, three, four Nigerian movies showing, and Nigerians are beginning to see Nigerian movies now sure. in the cinema. Sure. Mm -hmm. I know you know why? Yeah. Because we are making better films. Yes, mm. we are. Young directors, young, much more creative mind, young people who have less, fun, less funds, little money, 
they are putting it into work. Mm -hmm. They are making better films than what my father and your father did that year. Back, yes. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So we are, um, we have young creative people who struggle international, they go, go out, out of this country, they go to learn this thing properly, and they come back come here, back, yeah. they make better films. Wait, with, hold, hold up, yeah. hold up. We, are you saying that we don't have good schools here that can actually teach our young directors? The best film school in Nigeria is in Joss. Wow. And after sure. the Joss film school, I don't know of any other one. I cannot recommend any other one. You don't one. know of any other one. Or I you would cannot not recommend, recommend any oh, okay. other one. Yeah, that's yes, it's like two things. I, 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 I have worked with different people from Joss. In fact, I'm so ready to welcome any person from Joss Film School to my office. You're from good, come. Because those guys are good. So mm -hmm. apart from the guys from Joss, I don't know who else is. But guess what? These guys are still not being given enough opportunity mm -hmm. to explore their creative minds. Mm -hmm. So if the government can go to Joss, invest in the Joss Film School, give them more equipment to run practicals on, give them more opportunity to be much more creative, then create another Joss. The likes of myself when travel abroad to learn this thing. Sure. Mm. At the point when I wanted to go to school, to a film school, I would have gone to Joss. But shout out to Joss, but what I wanted to do, I didn't think Joss would give me what I needed at that time. So I had mm. to leave. And it wasn't easy. So think of about those other kids who would not be able to leave the way I left. Sure, mm. sure. Do you understand me? Sure. But give it to Joss. They are good at what they do. So impact them. Give them I, opportunity. I, I, I got into an argument yeah. with someone yeah. over something. OK, I've, I've been opportunity to work with you on a couple of productions, yeah, actually, sure. like four or five movies. Yeah. And I was telling someone, like, OK, so best one tell me, I want to shoot, shoot a short movie. I'm like, OK, yeah, we can do this in five, four days. The guy, mm -hmm. the guy looked at me like, Miles, as if you don't understand, I couldn't even defend myself. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I have worked on a production where we did a short movie in five days. Mm -hmm. And we were done. In fact, by the fifth day, the edit was almost finished. Mm -hmm. yeah. I said, please, you that you are the cocoa of this day, I, stayed there, I, did, I didn't know what work. to say to you, but I was trying to argue. But I mean, I mean. Films can be shot on different levels, right? I feel bad when I tell people I shoot a full, a full feature film for 10 days or six days. Sometimes I feel I very like, embarrassed. How do you do it? Do you I feel very it? embarrassed to say it. Do you understand me? Because that's something I probably want to spend three months filming. But the question is, when I am filming, I am my producer. Mm -hmm. I am my executive producer. I am my director. Sometimes I am my editor. You have mm. bills and all. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Because I have, to, I wish I could just sit down on, on my seat and say, action, cut. Do you understand me? But I cannot do that. Sometimes I want to go hang my lights. You get me? Sometimes I go on my camera and I rotate myself. Because it boils down to the fact that I have to write the script sometimes. I have to look for the money. Mm -hmm. I have to raise the money. Now, I am after raising the money, I know the limits of my funds. So I am careful. I need to go on set, shoot quickly, and get out. Mm -hmm. Now, you have the challenge of um, traffic, electricity, you understand, yeah. locations, yeah. right? So for you to transport from one location to the other is a problem. So I would love to film here. I, when I shoot two, three, four, five scenes here, and I want to go to the next location to shoot another scene, but when you think of the traffic, no, you have to stay here, shoot Finish it, everything. recreate the set, shoot the day. You know what I'm trying to say? So, I mean, I, I used to operate like that. So it's not like it's impossible. It's mm. possible. But does that help your creative mind? No. So if, if I have some executive producer that I say, okay, I have the money. Um, how long would you want to do this? I got you. Hello, you got me? Okay, I'll take my, t I'll take my time. Do you understand me? So, so but when you don't have that, you want to make go to in and get out. Yes, big to be warrior. But you know what the truth is? In the middle of our challenges, in the middle of our struggle, our um, limited funds, availability of funds, our technical, limited technical um, equipment, Nigerians are very creative. Sure. Do you understand me? We are very creative people. We make miracles. <laughs> I think that's the best way I can explain it. For every time I go on set and I feel my word, I say, God, thank you for this miracle. For me, it's a miracle because if it's, I don't know how I do them. 
Do you understand mm -hmm. me? Because this, when you go on set abroad, the director has like two assistants. The guy who's operating the camera has like two, three assistants. The guy who's pushing the track has like two, three assistants. The makeup artist has like two, three assistants. And everybody is, and the guy shoots one scene and says, I'm taking a cigarette yes. break. Ah, cigarette break in Nigeria, bow. <laughs> yeah. In fact, there was, there was this time I was on set and then it, they got some, the crew members from, yeah. I think from America, I can't remember what country now. And then there was this time that I wanted to shoot and I don't know what one of the guys saw and then it was like bad weather and oh, we're like, it's on. a wrap. Ah, it. bros. Yeah. Bad yeah. weather. You see, let me, let me give you, let me really? give you, let me give you, like, let me really? give you a gist. So I was in New York, I was supposed to film something and I'm the director. So I had the American uh, crew. crew. And the guy who is my, my DOP and my light guy, they came out in the afternoon. To me, ah, beautiful weather. The guy said, um, director, sir, um, the sun is coming from here. We don't have yeah. enough um, diffuser to, to block. <laughs> no, 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 I just chilled out looking at him. <laughs> eh. He said, uh, a Nigerian man is an executive producer, so I know what I'm talking about when it comes to money. The guy will give up on me here. Uh, I think we should strike for today. Money, eh? You go. I said, you, strike. Give me my camera. He said, no, how do you want to do this? I said, don't worry. Where I come from? African. No, 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 no. This way, that's the way you should say. You use umbrella. You use umbrella. So when I said I filmed, they, they were looking at me like I was stupid. And, and the shots are so beautiful. I'm like, yeah, it's, it's beautiful. It's a Nigerian. Yeah. It's magic. Yeah. 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 It's yeah. 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 Now, about, about, about shooting movies here in Nigeria. Okay, before the show, we, I asked about movies that you had done in the past, yeah. and then you said, and people you featured, you said Inedo like twice. I kept saying, okay, how many other films do you have Inedo in? And you said she's family. Yeah. Now, it brings me down to, there was this time I was with friends, like recently, yeah. and then we started talking. The person was like, um, the wedding party at this one. Ten days is Sunset at this one. Another movie, AY kept, AY used to like practically all the actors. He moved some actors from mm -hmm. the wedding party to mm -hmm. 10 days in Sun City, which is the same thing you have done with Inedo. Now, someone said they don't give younger artists um, the opportunity to grow and all of that. Do you think they'd say it's a click thing? So do you agree that it's a click thing or it's just you being comfortable with working with mm. a particular it's, set it's, of actors? It's, it's not, for me, it's not a click thing. For me, I don't know about, I can only speak for myself. For me, it's not a click thing. Um, I've, I have over 50, uh, uh, let me not say 50, I have over 40 feature films to my credit. Hmm. And I've only worked with Inedo on two. Oh, okay. So that's not a click thing. Okay. Do you understand? Okay. Um, it just, you, the question I remember was, what are the recent stuff you've done? You don't really we don't We happen to do, two stuff recently. Oh, okay. Just like how I have, um, I would still say I have over 40 films to my credit, feature films to my credit, and I've had Femi Jacobs in two. Do you understand me? Um, so it's, it's not a click thing, but the question is the script. Does she feel the character? Mm. Yes. Will she be able to deliver the role? Yes. And when it comes to my own production, I have a script. I have maybe five, six, seven actors. If I put two, three major faces, I try to give opportunity to, yeah. to the young cats. Yeah. And, 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 and I think I've, I've done that quite well. And um, if, if there's any reason why God will bless me, he knows I really, really try to create a platform for, others for, to grow. You know, for, for, for young people to grow. To, to grow. Okay, so what yeah. happened to you and the microphone? Why did you drop the microphone? Why did you drop singing? Why did you run away from it? Was it, was it hit too much? Because no. one soul used to be a musician, actually. That's where he started oh. everything. But yes, so, so he, he won't be singing did, He has songs today. with uh, Mood 9. He has <laughs> one with uh, Sam Sultan. He has another one called Mama. He has a, lot, a couple of songs. Oh, and what yeah. happened? You know, say, eh? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this one, eh, gets you. Oh my what God. happened to you? Nothing, no. Uh -huh. Nothing. But, bro, say, <laughs> you know, when you, music is a big part of me. Okay. Um, music helped me find my rhythm. Mm. At this, still, at this point, when I need to get creative, um, two things helps me a lot. Um, I'm, I don't smoke. I'm not really a smoker. For all yeah, the directors, not, not really. they, yeah. that, that's, their, that's their vibe. Do you drink? Um, occasionally. Oh, okay. you know. um, 
how I get my vibe when my head is full. I lock myself in a very dark, my room is very dark. I'm a very dark person. Um, dark room and music. Mm. Weird music, actually. They, they help me reboot my system. So music is a great part of me. Music helps me write. Music helps me find my feet. Music gave me answers when I needed them. It mm. creates... Music is my was, music is actually my beginning. Oh God, why you drop music? Why did you drop so it? So I, I didn't I, I didn't leave music. <laughs> okay. I've, I'm still music is still a part of me. Okay. The question would be when is the next single? Okay. single come, you know? So are you still going you to drop a, a single? I mean, with your busy schedule and all that. Watch out for it. <laughs> oh, well, when you when you shoot your movies, do you get to do the soundtrack? Do you uh, get it, to it, it depends on the film. It depends. Oh, okay. The, we, I have um, over. A million, two, three million um, sounds I have bought already. Okay. But there are sometimes you make a project okay. and then you you want to make original sounds okay. for them. So it depends. Sometimes you want to go to your library and just use that, or sometimes you want to. Mm. Let's do something score. real quick. Let's do something real quick. What's okay, that? so what was the last movie you did? What's the synopsis? Just briefly tell us what's the last movie about. The last movie would be. Uh, yeah. Uh, the therapy's therapy. What was it about? Um, bad Just market. It was, two it, was, it was two, two, two projects back to back. Okay. Bad market and therapy's therapy. Okay, let's do bad market. It sounds like... Mm -hmm. Okay, bad market. What's okay. the... Just tell us a line. Something that will just break down the movie and just give us like a... Uh, okay. The, it, it was about two funny guys who kidnapped in Yedo. Okay. And won a ransom. Okay. <laughs> and it didn't work for them. And it didn't work. It was bad yeah. market. And in Yedo happened to be a very, very bad market. The husband, ah. they, they were calling, was actually trying to get rid of the wife. Okay. Ah. So they actually done him a favor. Ah. <laughs> okay, so this is it. I want you to score. Let's do, let's, let's create a soundtrack for this movie right here, right now. Let's see how, how much of a creative singer and writer you are. So let's just do something, joking? something, just in line, something, something. That's, that's let's feel it all. That's performance money. It must now. not be, it must have uh, known. Uh -huh. You got to talk to my manager. I don't understand. <laughs> before the manager comes, before I talk to the manager, uh, let's see what you can do. Because we have a movie we're working on. And then we need someone to do the soundtrack. Do the soundtrack. Uh, so we need you to score uh, this one now. Just something. I mean, let's let's go on the commercial break. Oh, commercial break, okay? <laughs> <laughs> you think this is your audition room? Oh, but this is the the commercial. Room. You must take composing commercial right yeah. now. Yeah. 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 Let's, let's just free this. So you don't, you let's don't just free him. <laughs> Go commercial break. <laughs> All yeah. right. Yeah. Uh, real quick now, a lot of people are going to want to follow you on social media. Yeah. Yeah. How, how do they reach you? How do they reach you? Um, Instagram. Okay. I mean, there are too many things happening on social media these days, so I don't want to be everywhere. Okay. Um, I can't be, remember when last I was on Facebook. Oh. Uh, I can't remember last I was, uh, uh, I'm on Twitter, <laughs> but. Instagram, Instagram, I think I'm kind of like a regular on Instagram. So, so how, do they, how do they reach you? At One Soul is number one. One yeah. S O U L music film. Okay, so for one the rest word. of the year, before we get out of here, for the rest of the year, what are we expecting from the Heat Factory stable? Mm. Um, I have a feature film premiering this year. Okay. I also have a TV series okay. premiering this year. Um, I'm kicking off my, um, um, my African Dream project this year also where we take on different topical issues oh, okay the first one is going to be next month i'm going to be giving a lecture on domestic violence oh fantastic oh, nice. um, how, how can people be part of this uh, we would like people to come as one of the press team definitely. and also we will be there um, we definitely will people be there. out there yeah I, I need to correct some things about domestic violence mm. you know um i think it's been tagged as a cause on demand Hmm. You know, and the internet or the social media has not helped hmm. in any way. I'm not saying it doesn't exist. It does exist. It does. I'm not saying it's right. I am against domestic violence. I'm against any man that hits a woman. But the question is, the men, do they get abused? As well, you have a movie. You, yeah. you have a movie yes. about that called Wife Beater. Wife Beater. If you hear the title, you think that saying that the guy they beat the wife is mm. the wife that was beating the man. So, <laughs> so, so what's your people don't, now? People don't think men get abused. <laughs> we get Did abused. You, I though. think so. Mm. I think so. You you do, but yeah. people, other people, people don't. don't. She abuses so. me a lot, no. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I can't go through this again. But both both physically, mentally, mentally. Emotionally. You see, the physical one is the last. Yes. You the know, stage act, of domestic, yes. and guess what? The men are always the 
victim yeah, of the victim, right? It, yeah, physical it, act. Uh, yeah, so mm -hmm. uh, you don't hit me, you don't hit me. But there's what been you do, there's eh? been a process. There's been yeah, a very process. So for, for, for us to end domestic violence. We must end the process ways, that leads to it. Both ways. Yeah. yeah. All right. All righty, guys. That's it. That's it. That's it. We have to be out of here. For everybody who wants more questions and everything, go to his social media, that his uh, Instagram at Onesho Films, and ask him all the questions. Can be part of his movement and everything. Just ask him all the questions. Troll him for all you, for all we care. Thank you so very much for being part of the show. Thank Wonsho. you guys. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And we have to go. But the entertainment continues in just a bit. Do not move a muscle.